When we begin, you can start off really loud mm -hmm. and then end with a sort of boom and then I'll start the monologue. Mm -hmm. Okay, so go ahead. Unveiled is a one-woman play where I play five Muslim women from different backgrounds. There's a Pakistani seamstress, there's a Moroccan-American lawyer, there's an African-American uh, revert, not a convert, she's a revert, um, a London South Asian rapper, and a Middle Eastern restaurant owner. And these women, um, the monologues, are all framed around the preparation of tea. So they all have a tea from the Muslim world, and um, then they uh, begin to tell stories of how their lives changed after 9-11. If I let people treat me like garbage, my kids will grow up and do the same. So I turned around, looked him straight in the eye and said, Sir, you need to get an education because you're ignorant. I am not Al-Qaeda. I'm not one of those 19 terrorists. I don't support what they did. I don't believe it's Islam. Ellen is an Orthodox Christian, connected to her spirituality and her dedication to her religion and her faith. And so it's, it was just a wonderful experience to come see her on stage, seeing the playwright on stage acting. So it was a joy. The orange or the fruit? The fruit? Ha! What kind of idiot converts because of a fruit? On September 10th, most people felt like normal Americans. September 11th changed everything, and all of a sudden, a woman who wears the hijab was viewed with suspicion or spat at. Well, she, in, in this place, she represented a few American women who were very patriotic. Like in the last one, uh, it was a woman who felt that she had gone against American values for taking off her hijab. I wanted to tell those stories. I wanted to share, um, share these, these problems with an American audience so that they would become aware of what's going on and think about it. Well, for me, I mean, I really connected with you know, the events after September 11th, you know, as myself, I'm, you know, I'm cast as ethnically ambiguous all around town, so a lot of people also see me as Middle Eastern as well. One of my uncles that lives right around the corner, he's like, hey, he's Spanish, he's like, Mija, don't get out of the house because they're killing, they're killing Middle Eastern people on 63rd on And what? And God knows we look Middle East. <laughs> You know, Timothy McVeigh is like a blonde-haired, light-eyed, white male who killed 150 people. But we did And no one realize. walks around thinking every blonde dude is trying to bomb us. I know. In Unveiled, when the rapper mentions Timothy McVeigh, I've noticed people say, oh, they have like an aha moment from that, because they never thought about that double standard. Mm -hmm. But it does exist. Women went down in Oklahoma, you blame McVeigh. No Christian preacher, nobody say that's what the Bible teacher. And I seen people with the veil on. I thought that they were celebrating the fact that, the, that America got attacked. And I was ignorant. And, and that's why I had to apologize to her. Because I felt awful for what I had thought and what I didn't know. <laughs> I walked away from the play like it changed my life. That's what her play is about, is touching audiences. I just have been uh, so moved by the effect it's had on the people that walk in the building. I was moved by her performance and by what she was able to convey. I was also moved by this full uh, sanctuary full of peoples of all different uh, faiths uh, and backgrounds and neighborhoods from Chicago coming together, uh, seeing itself as one, one community, one constituency. She had called all these people and they kept saying no, and she was about ready to give up on the whole thing. <laughs> and she made one more phone call and that was me. And um, 
And I thought it was just a great idea. I, I was just delighted at the entire idea of it. My husband worked with some Muslims. And I've known how hard it has been in so many different ways. It, ma it makes America more of a beautiful place because there are all those different cultures. And I think people who want, like, um, quote unquote, like, Arabs to get out of the country, they don't, they don't understand that, like, America is a country of immigrants. Maybe this is just the right time because of the current climate. There are a lot of artistic directors that are interested in exploring um, the voice of a Muslim woman playwright because it's a voice that's not often heard.